taking the strain, chanting as they come. Kaiapoi High School pupils pulling two fully laden fire engines along the town's streets towards their school following a very early start to the day as part of a peer leadership program called Cactus. It's a great program where we get up uh, three days a week on a Monday, Wednesday and a Friday. Come down to school and at 6.20 we do fitness. Um, it's a way of learning team building and leadership for uh, people in the group. Uh, today was the longest day. We got up at 5 o'clock in the morning. We stayed the night at school previously, last night. Kaipoi High Head Boy Flynn Johnson is pleased to have been working with a group of people he says he'd not typically get to know. Well, it's been great today, um, the whole term we've been leading up to this one challenge and personally I've just loved working with these, um, just these people that normally I wouldn't, wouldn't have much to do with so it's been great to meet new people and also the fitness side of things as well, it's been great for me personally, feeling a lot fitter. And yeah, it's just been a great mental and physical challenge. Cactus members were honoured with a haka as they pulled the fire engines past the Cultural Studies Centre Tikohiko and when they arrived at the school. With the strain on his face still evident, Johnson says pulling two fire engines was a heck of a workout and more than just a physical one. Oh, well I started pulling it and 100 metres into it, I thought we should be done by now, I'm stuffed. Uh, but nah, you just dig deep, get that stamina going and those mental things we've learnt throughout the term. And um, yeah, nah, pulled through and everyone, everyone did their part and we got here in the end. The programme is run at the school each term with different intakes of pupils each time and Johnson says some people who do the course in year 10 choose to repeat it in their senior years. In Kaipoi, the South Today.